Hey guys, my name is Dave, welcome to another video. So, prior to the creation of this video, not the upload, the creation, um, there's a part of the description that I've gone through and removed on all thousand some odd videos that I have on this channel. A little bit of a backstory on this, though. Before this, there were, for those who don't know, before this there were two links in the description that I used to constantly place. One of them is a link to my channel, which, you know, makes sense. But the other one was a link to a chan- to not a channel on here. Every video of the- prior to this, and in the future, aside from Pig Fox, since she is a co-owner of this channel as of, well, ever since she and I got engaged, um, there was a different type of link that was put in the description. That link was a link to a Patreon that I was told I should make. However, I've been wondering recently, there are certain events that I'm not going to talk about, it's because I feel like they're irrelevant to talk about. I mean, they're not irrelevant, but irre they're, they're, I don't think they're necessary to bring up. I do wonder... Do people actually pay attention to the description? Honestly, one of the reasons why the link that I had, the Patreon link I had put in, was because I didn't think many people actually did pay attention to the description. Up until very recently. I just, I don't know. For some reason, I've always, like, I do pay attention to them myself. I... But the thing is... It just felt like to me for some reason that most people didn't. I don't know though. Because I put witty things in the description, I put warnings sometimes on certain types of videos. Jokingly for the most part. But I also put, you know... Some statements like that. Links. I feel like just, I guess, at a point in my life, I felt like no one really... Like, people would see the videos I put, but no one would really click those links, because no re one really looked at the description. That's kind of just how my brain figured it went. But recent events, as of the recording of this video, made me wonder... Is that really the case? It's starting to feel like it's not. And for anybody out there who's going, well, duh, I pay attention to the description. Okay, alright. My brain isn't exactly the most properly functioned thing, which is a discussion for a different day. But I can say this, at least from that particular type of topic. What? I have been put through has caused me to process things a little bit slower and look at things from different angles to the point where sometimes it just doesn't make sense. I am willing to admit that. However, once again, by the time this video goes up, these particular links, they're gone. You can look through every single video. You won't find it. You won't find it in any of them. I just felt like I would try it for a little bit, and if it wasn't going anywhere upward, like if it wasn't beneficially going anywhere, I'd be like, you know what? I'll just remove it. And you know what? Yeah, it hasn't really gone anywhere, so I'm. by the time this video goes up, you won't see these in any of the videos anymore. Not even the link to the channel, especially since it's always shows up like right down here in these videos and like either here or here 
uh, at the end of the game videos and the later portions of the day. One way or the other, this is just something that kind of went through my head. Uh, most, I, I just, because sometimes, I, I will admit, sometimes I pay attention to them, but sometimes I don't. Out of curiosity, I'll see what the description says, and there are certain circumstances where I'll notice something at the top of the description and my brain's like, and I'll read it. But sometimes, eh, it just, I kind of just watch the video and I press the like button on whatever video I want, actually. I can't think of a one video aside from YouTube Rewind where I've pushed this. I don't think there's one video that I've put a dislike on that's not YouTube Rewind. Actually, I could think of a couple, but eh, those those are kind of irrelevant to what I'm talking about. Huh. I don't know. Now that I'm thinking about it, how important is the description of a video? Because most of the time, I will admit, most of the time in my videos, um, I'm actually looking at the, a list of Every time I look up the way I am, I'm actually looking at a list of the videos that I have scheduled, not uploaded, scheduled for upload, which I always have a week ahead of time, at the minimum, just in case I have some stuff going on and I need to take a little bit of a hiatus or break. That way nothing is missed. I don't, to me, missing a day of uploads will bug the crap out of me. If you rewind back enough, this won't be such a big deal, but I'm but I digress. I'm looking at the descriptions of some of the videos I've done. Um, some of them are kind of like, they ref they're they always on core to the topic of the videos. But if someone was to read, because I've already, like I was saying I was going, I, I was going to do after the creation of this video, but I've already done by the time you guys see this, with these videos, those links are gone. But the words that are still there are ex are relevant to the videos, but if you were to bypass them, it would do nothing. Well, let me make sure I'm... My brain is like going through this. Uh, how many of these have I removed them? What the heck? Uh, never mind. I'm like looking through the, the descriptions and I'm finding some things, but don't worry about it. Um, anyway, yeah. How, what do you guys think? I am very curious. This is kind of the main point I made this video. I know I've been rambling about it for a little while, but what do you guys think? Is the description important? Do, do you guys think that do you guys actually read the description or do you just bypass it? I am very curious. So let me know in the comments below. I legitimately want to know. Um, if you want to check out any of the live stuff I talked about in regards to like discussions or rants, kind of like this one, or this, the other ones are probably more psychological or uh, philosophical, which knowing me might make a bit more sense. Uh, but if you do want to check out any videos like that, click the link on the left side of my head. Or if that, it doesn't, if that doesn't fill your boat quite, and the uh, YouTube just, like picks out something that might suit you guys a bit more, it should show up on the other side of my head. Don't want to watch that? Why not check out the channel itself? As I said, I have more. I have over a thousand videos for some for someone who only has like a little over five hundred subs. Maybe. I have somewhere around 500 subs. Um, I have to actually double check my source. I'm not looking at the numbers right now. Anyway, as, well, as of this recording, I think I have about a little over. Anyway, thanks again for watching this video, guys. Uh, make sure to push that like button, share it out, and consider subscribing if you have not yet. I'm going to head off. Thanks again, guys. Hope to see you all in another video. Bye for now. Dang it, that usually works. <laughs>